everybody. Dawn here, the quilt lady here in Kingfisher, uh, coming to you tonight. Oops, you about called me Cherie. <laughs> My husband put Cherie's <laughs> name up there. Okay, I, I can be Cherie for a day. Anyways, Dawn hey. here. So we've got a good show tonight. Looks like we've got about 14 people on. Good. Wow. Uh, you guys tell me who all's on here. Oh, we've got 15. Oh, hey, Joyce. How's the knee getting along, girl? Joyce has had knee surgery, so uh, just came out of it, oh, not even about a month out, I guess. So she's uh, still recouping. So I hope you're doing okay. And Terry, hey, Terry. What did Terry do last week? What did Terry do last week? Terry came to the social. Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. Yeah, Terry, Terry came to the social, you guys. So I'm going to tell you all about the social on Wednesdays that we have. And uh, anybody can come and it's free and you get to come in and sew and meet new people and everything. So we're just getting that started. So Terry came. It was fun. And Liz from Montana. Ooh. Great. Hey, Liz. Home of Yellowstone. Yes. Home of Yellowstone. Glad to uh, glad to have you, Liz. That's awesome. Very good. Let's see. How, who else do we have Bill's running the deal tonight. Oh, thank you so much. If you get this way, you need to come see us. You'll love it. It's nice and bright and uh, you can breathe. We've got lots of room now. Hey, Pat. That's not from quite as far away. Yeah, Pat's closer. Pat's from Bison. Bison in Montana. There is Bison in Montana. Yeah. Yeah. So good. Good. Glad you're here, Pat. Who else do we have? Kathy. Oh, hey, Kathy. How are you, girl? So one of my very good friends, this is her sister from Enid. Enid, Kathy was a teacher. Oh, so good, good to have you. you. And oh, Alma. Alma, where did Alma from? Alma, where are you from, girl? Comment where you're from. Yeah, let us know where you're from. I think she's a new viewer, apparently. Are you new? I don't think I've seen her before. I don't think I've seen you before either, so oh, welcome. What do new viewers need to do? Welcome. Okay, if you're new, let me tell you real quick. If you share, so share your share your uh, deal publicly and then put down there that you've shared, you get into a drawing and we draw a gift card. Okay. And, also they need to go and you have to be present to win. So uh, you'll put your name down this week and then next week we'll draw for this week who was on this week. And you have to be present to win. And how many ever shares we have is how big the gift card is. They also need to so. go to our website. Oh, okay. And, and the website. Yeah. This is the website and you need to register. What is our website? Website is quilt-lady.com. Yeah. Quilt-lady.com. And right there at the front, it says first name, last name, email, and subscribe. It's right there on the homepage. It's right there on the homepage. So you go and fill that out and uh, let us know. You got to register. So we had a couple problems with Instagram, no. um, or not Instagram, YouTube, sorry, a couple weeks ago where there was some orders on YouTube. But so if you're on tonight and you ordered on YouTube, you must register you because uh, I had a couple people that didn't have their name out there. They had like, they had a user. yeah, they had a username. It wasn't their name. And we didn't know who to bill for it or give it to. So um, if you be sure and register, then that way we know who's who's out there. Oh, hey, Linda, your sister's on. <laughs> sisters, there they go. Okay, good. I'm glad you're here. Mary Harrison, good. She's already shared. You got us going, Mary. That's great. I love it. Tuttle. Oh, you was in last week, Aunt Helen. Okay, great. Thank you. I love it. So you got to come see the new building. That's great. As many as y'all want to come, that's awesome. Everybody's coming oh, in to see the building. I was an extra on Yellow Street. Oh, she was an, you was? Hey, you're a celebrity. I love that. Well, Even two seconds, that works. You can say you was on Yellowstone. Nobody needs to know it's two seconds. <laughs> as famous as the huh? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I have uh, some, I'm going to do some teaching tonight. Uh, Janice had asked a bunch of questions today 
about different threads and bobbins and some stuff for long arms. So she asked a bunch of questions. She said, you need to do a live and give us some information. I said, okay, I'm going to do that. And I'm looking around. I don't see Janice's samples that I was going to show. Are they here? I think they're over on, on the deal if you want to grab them. Anyways, i got some samples to show you tonight, too. Janice Russell has been at it again, girls. She has made all kinds of samples again. So I'm going to show you some more. And we did find the book um, that the one quilt was in. I don't know if it's still here. We'll show it that we showed last week. And I wasn't sure what the book was. It's a three-yard quilt book. Okay. Sorry. I'll quit talking to Bill and talk to y'all. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, let's get started. I'm going to, um, there'll be more coming on because we're just right at seven. And so for those of you that are new, <laughs> we're more than a more than a fabric store. Uh, we do long arm quilting, okay, long arm. And we do the binding. So if you need, if you do your own long arming or if we do the long arming and you want us to bind, we do that too, okay? Um, machine repair, Bill does that. And scissor sharpening. So if you have scissors, you need sharpen. He'll sharpen those up. If you have a guild that you go to and you want him to come or a retreat and you want him to come to your retreat and sharpen scissors for everybody there, um, I think he, he has to have a guarantee of so much. There you go. Or so many of you um, to do that. And he will travel and do that. Okay. So. And we're even thinking about having a work a, a come over here and tell a, them a work no yeah a sharpening okay he's saying we're going to have a sharpening work day so we're going to have a pick a day and you guys will come in and bring your scissors and he'll sharpen them while you while you wait okay so that's that's coming soon we do embroidery we do we have AccuQuilt products quilt making lots of lots of quilt making uh, of course and classes uh which we've started now and that i'm so pumped up about i just i love to teach and so we've started classes and we do alterations okay so we have we have a lady that works for us that does alterations so okay so if you're new any of those that uh you see or anything else that you can think of holler and we may just may I'm just do it I'm a her aunt Helen was, Helen was the one that won the prize. Oh, Alma, yes. Alma Your aunt was the one that won the prize. So Ellen Jones was the one, if you guys remember, everybody put their um, name in the pot for the grand, grand prize, okay? And we did that after customer appreciation, and Ellen won that. So she came in, and I think we've got pictures not posted yet. Um, Sheree hasn't been here much to be able to get online. And so hopefully when she has been here, she's been overloaded. So uh, we'll try to get that picture posted of Ellen and, and us with the with her uh, win, her swag bags. So, okay, let's see what the next slide. Okay, you guys, we do retreats. They're called P31 because we do Proverbs 31 woman. So I have a devotional each night uh, for us that is about the Proverbs 31 woman. And so you can read that over before you come if you want. You don't have to. I'll tell you all about it. But uh, these, these retreats right now that I'm talking about are at Call City. They are four nights, five days. All your meals are included um, except one. We go out to eat one meal. And there's a mystery project so along that is always fun. We have done several different mysteries and they've all been a hit and fun, but something fast and easy. OK, we do a round robin. So the round robin this year or this year, this retreat is going to be. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Um, and if you guys don't know what a round robin is, that is where. You um, a little bird that hops around in your yard this time of year. No, the that is where you bring a block, and I'm going to bring the center block, and then everybody that puts their border around it puts a border around it. 
is in for the drawing. And at the end of the week, somebody wins that quilt, that quilt top. And then they get to uh, have it quilted and they have a quilt top. And then they make the center for the next one. Okay, so here is the center for the one that's coming up. And this is a bird. It's by Poppy Cotton. Hey, Janice. Such fun. Um, this, is the, this is by Poppy Cotton. This is the bird. So that is going to be the center block. Okay, so everybody that puts goes around that block will be in for the drawing. <clears throat> okay, so that's a round robin. And then we do, of course, daily uh, devotionals for Proverbs 31 women. And then there's lots of other surprises. We have lots of games. Um, if you are in a retreat, if you will check Facebook, I did post today some of the stuff that you will um, need to know. So the ones that is July, or June and July, June 28th through July 2nd, I did post just a little bit ago what all you need to bring. So we're going to do um, several things on that. So go look at the go look at the P31 site. OK. Yeah, the group page on Facebook. OK, the we have a September one also. It's all full. Uh, June, July has two openings left. So if you want to get in on June, July, go to the website and we'll show you that here in a sec. Um, then we have an, a late November or a late fall. I'm sorry, not late November. We're Thanksgiving. This is November 15th through the 19th. Okay, 15th through the 19th, four nights, five days. Everything's the same on each retreat. Okay, so your meals, your round robin, the mystery project, um, all that. We play games and there's there'll be more information on Facebook. Okay. All right, so that one's the 15th through the 19th, and that one is 350. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Let's go to, um, let me talk to them about classes real quick. Let's do classes, and then I'm going to talk to you about the block of the month. Okay. So, classes, uh, this is the website. Go if you go to quilt lady.com, quilt lady.com, you're going to come up with this, this page. Okay. <clears throat> this is where you sign up and you uh, register. If you order anything online, you can um, shop, you can, you can do everything on this site. Okay. That's a picture of the old shop. Cherie's got cameras coming up and she's going to have new pictures coming out soon. Okay. All right. So this is, you can kind of scroll through there and see, but if you go back, there's Joyce and Terry. Thelma and Louise. Okay. So we'll give you we'll give you nicknames when you come. <laughs> Thelma and Louise. Okay. So third third uh, thing over is classes and retreats. So if you go and click on that, it's going to bring you to classes. Okay. So uh, the first class we had a class today, and I'll go through that in a minute. But this C one hundred and one that is a barn quilt workshop. So that is where we're going to paint a barn quilt. It's going to be two foot by two foot. Okay. So that's a pretty good size, two foot by two foot. And it's $50. Okay. Lunch is provided. So this one's a little higher, but we are providing a, a nice lunch for you. Okay. We will have it set up with plastic on the floor and paint ready. So you're going to get your board. That's a two foot by two foot. And then it's already been sanded and sealed, okay? Um, or not sealed, what do I wanna say? Um, what's the grip? Primed, primed. It's gonna be primed already, okay? So part of the work is taken out of for you and we're gonna show you how to lay your block out and get it, get it drawn on so we can paint it, okay? And so those will be complete that day. So that's a Saturday, so those people that work can uh, still, still come. It's nine to four. Okay. Nine to four. So that, uh, the shop opens at 10, but the class starts at nine. Okay. Nine to four. There's 11 seats available. All right. Okay. So you would just hit add to cart and that one would be, uh, in your cart and you can pay for it. You have to pay for it and register before class. Okay. So we have to know, so she can know how many, boards to bring and we know, need to know how many lunches to have uh, catered. Okay. All right. The next one is the just can't cut it. And I'm going to show you that. I 
I put that out and I didn't think about you guys not seeing the seeing the pattern is one thing, but seeing the quilt is a whole nother. So the Just Can't Cut It was a $49.99 uh, class and it was today. So I'm sorry if you missed it. We had great fun. And Bill, you want to help me hold this? Let me have him help me hold this up. This is what we made today. So this is the borders, but you have your um, focal fabric. Okay, so you'll have a, that's why it's called Just Can't Cut It. You have a focal fabric and then you have five other pieces. Okay, and then you have two borders. So this is the quilt that we made today. Really fun quilt. Now mine's been quilted and I've got roses because mine's, here, take that. Mine's got roses on the front. So I quilted roses. Oops, you can't, you can't see, see it that. very good. Yeah, so I quilted roses on the back. Eh, maybe, yeah, there we go, into the minky. Yeah. Okay, so that's what we did today. I'll let you fold that. Yeah, well, thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so that's what we did today is the Just Can't Cut It class. Mm -hmm. So if you're interested in that class again, uh, it's off the calendar now, but we can always schedule another one. So if you're if you're interested, put down that you're interested in that class, okay? And Bill can um, look at it. Write down, name, write down names or something. Okay, so we have a log cabin class. Now, this is $86.99, but that is including the book, okay? So the, the class is actually $60. The book is $26.99. And so um, to get both, it's $86.99. If you already have this book, it's just $60, okay? So that is the log cabin. It's a two-day class a two-day class, and uh, I think that's just like $7 and something an hour. So that's not bad. Come and quilt, and I'll show you a fast, easy way to make a log cabin. You can put these together tons of different ways, and uh, you can make this block forever and have a new quilt every time. There's a lot of different ways to put this together. Okay. So the log cabin is two classes, and those are, let's see, where are they? Oh, there we are, May 30th and June 20th. So I'm going to give you three weeks in between to do a little bit of homework, do some of your blocks, okay? So it starts May 30th. We have 20 seats available, May 30th through June 20th, or not through, May 30th and June 20th, okay? So I believe that's both on a Tuesday. Yep both on a Tuesday, okay? 12 to 4. And so, on the 20th, y'all could have a birthday party for me. <laughs> Bill's wanting a birthday party on the 20th. My we'll see. Birthday is we'll see. We might, we might surprise you. Okay, so that's the log cabin. Then let's see what other we have. Um, memory quilts. So if you have any t-shirts or anything like that that you want to make into a, a quilt, there's two different classes you can take. This one is 190. Now, don't let that scare you because the class is actually only 80, but the ruler template set that comes with it is 110. You get to keep those. There's 10 rulers starting at a 16 and a half inch square. Okay, so you get 10 rulers with this for $110. And so it's 190, but you'll have it to make any quilts that you want to make from now on. Okay. And we're going to show you a really cool, easy way to put these together. All right. So that one is uh, two classes also, June 6th and June 9th, which is going to be a Tuesday and a Friday, I think. Let's see. June 6th and 9th. Yep. Yeah, Tuesday and Friday. A Tuesday and Friday, 10 to 2. 10 to 2. Okay. So a real exciting new way to do your t-shirt quilts and you can use lots of shirts if you need to, okay? All right, then we have um, the TQL social is on Wednesdays. That's what Terry came to. So any Wednesday that you guys wanna come, uh, except for we have kids class, kids camp one week, yeah. So pretty much any Wednesday, check our schedule and pretty much any Wednesday you can come in from 10 to four and so you can use our classroom, it's lit, it's cooled um, and 
if we're back and forth, we can help you if, we, if needed. Okay. All right. So that one's free. And then, okay. And then we have the, and then if you want to go and, and retreat. sign up for retreats, register for retreats, that's where you do. It says classes and retreats and you scroll down there and that's going to show you the retreats. Okay. So you sign up for which one you just sign up for all five sessions, select, and it'll take you uh, there. You have to have it paid for to be able to save your seat in that retreat. Okay. And the same with classes. All right. So let's get out of that and let's get on to our stuff. Okay. So enough about classes. One more exciting thing, and I have wanted to do this so much. I love this. This is going to be our um, block of the month. Okay. Oh, my hair is all out of place. Okay. Yeah, there we go. So he's got it up there. That's our block of the month. It's 52 by 68, and it has got the cutest little pattern. So I showed these last week. I don't know if, if everybody's been on here. So I'm going to show them again. This is Poppy Cotton, uh, and the quilt name is Country Blessings, okay? It's $35 to register, and then it's $30.99 a month. So it has free, we're going to do free shipping on this, and so we will ship it to you for nothing, and the registration, um, and then the monthly fee, okay? Um, the, and I'm going to show you some of these blocks. These are not in order, but this is the Bluebird. So this is the one that I made. I made a couple of these because this is going to be our block that um, is the center of our round robin. Okay, so there's that one. Here's the strawberry block. And it is these very exact same fabrics that I've used here. Okay, and look at this cute bunny. Look at the bunny block. Oh, my gosh. Isn't that cute? Looks like dinner. <laughs> Here's a chicken. The chicken block. Am I holding it? Oh, I need to go up there. Chicken block. It's like a chicken. That, okay. It's like a chicken that's a medic. Okay. There's the bee. What? Here is the barn. Okay. This one's really cute. You need to move over because they can't see you. I that's okay. There's the there's no, the sewing machine. They can't see the blocks. Okay. They can't see the blocks. Yeah, you have to okay. come There's, this direction with the blocks. They can see it. No, they can't. Okay. There's the uh, sewing machine. Okay. Here is the kisses and hugs. Kisses and hugs. Okay. Mushrooms. The flags. The stars, that cute, and the flowers. So a really cute, cute block of the month. I need to show the first few again because they couldn't see it. Okay, he's saying show you the first few again because you couldn't see the pieces. Okay, from what the barn up. Okay, yeah. we'll go back. Here's the barn. So there's 12 blocks, you guys, and then there is uh, sashing and borders, okay? And the sashing and borders are a pieced um, patchwork also, and so you'll get all the, all the print with that, okay? You'll get the whole thing. There's the bunny, the strawberries, oops, strawberries, and the bluebird. So I don't know if you've seen all those. You can put the um, picture back up real quick. But they're all in here. And um, again, $35 to register and $30.99 a month. So if you want that, you can go on the on this site to quilt-lady.com. It's at the very top, and you can sign up for it, okay? But well, actually, you might want to uh, sign up because the very first block is June, June 1st, okay? So as soon as you sign up, you get in. If you don't sign up for the next month, then you would pay the 35 plus the first month to, to catch up, okay? All right, that's okay. Let's go on. Um, we are getting ready for Shop Hop, as you know. 
and that is coming shop hop is coming starting june 1st so that's this week okay and the shop hop uh fabric is right here uh we've got the two wheat the gold and the brown and then the uh, blue and green oklahoma and it's hard to see because this is back but this is our block okay this is the block that i made and this here the blue in the center is the oklahoma blue it's got the oklahoma on it and then this here is the golden wheat okay that's the golden wheat as well as in our finishing kit we have the golden wheat so and then the map the white has the map of oklahoma on it it's got the towns names and stuff so this is our block if you want the um pre-cut kit it's 7.99 and this is what it's going to come like you're going to get a package and ours is all laser cut so it's great you're going to end up with you'll have a, a pattern all in color and then you're going to end up with nine different cuts different size cuts and you've got all your pieces and these are already i'll show you so clint and bill put these together so this is all all going to be already like this and all you got to do is snip that little piece right there and you've got four pieces okay so this is all put together like that everything's laser cut for you and ready to sew together so that's the best thing about ours is it's you don't have to go home and cut it and stuff so you can see that it's got the oklahoma fabric there and then the road map there's lots of road map fabric in there and um, again they're 7.99 we are not allowed to mail them out you can call and order some if you're not in oklahoma and you're not going to make shop hop if you want the block you can call and order order it and we can uh, send it out on august 1st but it has to be after shop hop so we can send out how many blocks you want. Our, our um, finishing kit has this extra uh, block in it. And then the way it's put together, can you take that down so they can see a little bit more quilt? Sure. Just a minute. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you can see more of the quilt um, size. But that this has got the, or the Oklahoma wheat in it. And our borders will have the blue and the wheat, the brown wheat, actually, and the white, blue, blue, brown, and white. Okay, so. Did you tell them what the shop hop was? For those shop hop, know? and for those of you that don't know, is you go from shop to shop. There's 27 shops. Thank you, Joyce. Uh, there's 27 shops. If you go to each shop, you will get a passport, and we do not have our passports yet. They haven't sent them to us um, and you will get it stamped at each shop. Then when at the last shop, you'll turn it in and how many, if you've made it to all the shops, then there is lots and lots of prizes that we've given um, lots of prizes. There's machines, there's gift certificates. There, there's all kinds of product in there. Okay. So, and even if you just do uh, believe a regional area, then if you make it all to your region, there's prizes for that. Okay. All right. And then I believe each shop gives away. I think each shop gives away something, right? There's something yeah. Each. There's something from each shop. So you've got lots of chances to win. Okay. Um, okay. So tonight I'm going to show you, uh, I'm going to show you a few samples first. Let's do the samples first and show you. Yeah, we got 64 on. That's great. They need to do? You guys need to be sure and share if you haven't shared. Let's move this all over here so I can show it. Oops. Okay. Set this down here. Okay. Janice Russell brought this all in today. And Janice, man, she's, she sews and sews and sews. She gets it done. Yeah, look like you have that, Bill. That's not put together. Okay. So we have this lovely fabric that's very popular and it's the lemonade or the mason jars with the lemonade different lemonades in them okay and this is 13.99 13.99 and this is mine one mine one 
Okay, so a yard minimum, yard minimum. And I'm gonna show you what we did with this, the lemonade. And then I'm gonna show you this um, watermelon. So this is the watermelon, okay? Cute 4th of July, really cute 4th of July or summer. And this is also $13.99. And this is mine number two, mine number two. I thought maybe you'd put that out there on the deal, mine two. Okay, watermelon is mine two, and the lemonade is mine one. Okay, so, the, and we have these panels, y'all, and they are darling. So, Janice just finished them. So, this is lemon squeeze, or easy peasy lemon squeezy, okay? And on the back, she's got the lemonade. And this is still part of the panel. You get several of these. Here we go. It's going to be a great day. Isn't that cute? And again, the lemonade. Okay. This one has got the watermelon. And it's got the watermelon back. Isn't that cute? And then we have the pear and the lemonade, the grapes and apple. Again, with the lemonade on the back. Here's a different watermelon. Watermelon, watermelon back. And the pitcher of lemonade, this is the last one, the pitcher of lemonade with the lemonade back. Okay, so that is a panel. That's a panel with all this, The you would have to buy the backing fabric, but all these placemats are on the front in that panel. Okay, and that is mine number three. Mine number three. What is mine three? the panel, the placement panel. Okay. Then I don't. Um, okay. He's going to look that up for a price on that uh, placement panel. And I believe it's June, June or July. It's the one with the watermelons. Okay. Then she made this um, table runner and it's got the um, campers on it. Isn't that cute? Let's go this way. So it's got the camper on that. That is darling. Okay. Um, these patterns are, oh, this might not be marked either. It is not. Okay. These are usually pretty inexpensive patterns. The Annie's. How much is those Annie's books over there? Do you know? Okay. I'll find out for y'all. Anyways, there are lots of, lots of cute. So this is a placemat panel, and that is uh, in the Annie's book, okay? Annie's quilting. Home is where the camper is. Home is where the camper is. So what are we on? Mine four? Mine number four. Mine four will get you the book, the Annie's camper, okay? Can you look up Annie? And let's see what those are for them. Oops. All right. Then we have this really cute pillow, you guys. Look at this. Isn't that darling? You see the whole thing? There you go. That is so cute. These, these are the bench pillows. Charming chicks. Charming chicks. And this just piece, she did the blue and gold down at the, or blue and yellow down at the bottom. That's so popular. This one is uh, done with all different color pieces. All right. Charming Chicks. And that's another by Annie. Uh, not by Annie, sorry. Annie's. We have Annie's and by Annie's. This is an Annie's. Okay. Did you find that? Okay, find this one too. He's going to get your prices on those. All right, where was we at? Mine, one, two, three, four. So we're on one, five. Okay, so for you long armors out there, we have these stretch bars. We are getting in more and more stuff for the people that long arm or mid arm, short arm, anything that you're gonna do to quilt, okay? So these have, these are Velcro, okay? And they Velcro over to your sidebars and you snap the quilt 
and be able to stretch it out so that holds your um, backing flat, okay? So no wrinkles or anything like that. So these are great. I use, I use clamps like this and they go right out and Velcro to the side. All right, so this is for any kind of long arming, long arm, mid arm, or short arm, okay? So that is for your um, stretching, your stretching bars, okay? This is my number five, and it's $29.99, $29.99. Um, if you are interested in the red snappers, I'm not sure uh, how many of you have heard about red snappers, I have those on my machine and they work wonderful. So it's like a red tube, like a PVC tube. No, it's more of a plastic tube. And then it has a clamp that fits over on the top of it. And so I have ordered those, don't have them in yet, but that is also for the long arm people, okay? So the clamps are $29.99 and it's my number five, okay? All right. Another thing with the long arm, we have these little teeny tiny, teeny tiny steel crochet hook. You cannot even see, it looks like it's a point on the end. It, it's soft touch steel crochet hook. Soft touch. Okay, so these are, um, it's a number 10. This has got the tiniest hook. So you know how when you, have long armed or even making anything and you see a piece of black thread under your white fabric. It's like, oh, that got quilted in there. Any color of thread that you can see under there, this will fit right through the weave of your fabric. And it's so tiny. All you got to do is catch that thread and it pulls right out. I've used this all the time on the ones I do. Okay. So a little teeny tiny crochet hook is going to pull out any threads that is under something that you can't get to. All right. Um, these are $8.99. $8.99. And that is the soft touch crochet hook. Okay. Let's see. So continuing on, I've got one other long arm thing I want to tell you about that you can use for long arm or any of it. And that is thread. So Janice asked me to do a little tutorial tonight on thread. So you guys would know something about thread. So this is some of the thread that we use, signature that I use on my long arm. Okay. Um, the variegated thread is $28.99. It's much higher than the regular thread. So $28.99 for variegated. Okay. And we have different colors. So if you let us know, if you're interested and let us know what color, we can get you whatever color, okay? Uh, this one happens to be the purples. This would be a Joyce Gunder thing. She's a purple girl, aren't you Joyce? <laughs> okay, then um, we have signature, regular signature thread, which works great. You can use this on your sewing machine also. Um, we have black, $12.99. Red twelve ninety. Well, this is more of a coral twelve ninety nine, and red twelve ninety nine. Any of the colors that we have over there, uh, solid colors twelve ninety nine. Variegateds are going to be double twenty eight ninety nine. Okay, over double. They're high. Okay, so we have all kinds of different threads. Um, let's see. We also okay. So if you want threads, put down. Um, Mine number six, that's for a signature, and then put the color. No, mine seven. Mine seven, sorry. Mine seven, and then put the color that you would like, okay? And mine eight for the variegated. Mine eight for the variegated. Okay. I also use these sometimes on my regular sewing machine. It just depends. Generally, I use Aurifil, okay? Okay. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you why. RFL is, is made for no lint. So if you want your machine not to have to be cleaned as much, and I have, I live with the cleaning guy, but you know, when it's your own house, you don't always get that. You don't always get it serviced yourself, right? So the RFL has no lint and your machine will not be all junked up with lint. 
So that's the great thing about this. And it's 50 weight. Okay. These, um, I believe these are 40 weight. So this is 40 weight. So a little bit thicker than the 50 weight. Okay. That you put through machines, but this will work. So what I do is I put it on a cone stand. So it looks just like this, this cone stand, this, this, uh, arm fits down in there. And then you have the arm that fits in the middle, this sets on it and you can put it behind your machine. Lot of thread, 3000 yards, 3000 yards on this. Okay. So you would need a cone stand because if you set it down behind, it's going to roll all over the place and it's not going to give you, it's not going to work. You need a stand. Okay. All right. So the cone stand is $8.99, $8.99 and it's mine number nine. Cone thread holder. Okay. Let him get that up there. Then this little thing is very expensive. I'll just tell you, they're high, but man, are they worth it. So if you have trouble with your machine going from regular bobbins to pre-wound bobbins, or you have any kind of tension problems, uh, most of the time they bring it to Bill to have them clean the machine. And sometimes they do need to be cleaned. If they're full of lint and they need lube and stuff, then they do need that. Well, this is a bobbin case TOA gauge, okay? This is a tension gauge, but it's called a TOA gauge. It's made by TOA. And see how it's got there? You're going to take, this is not for drop-in bobbins. This is for the, drop -in, the bobbin that you put into the holder. It's got the little arm sticking up. You put it into the holder. You add the holder into here and then put your thread around here and then cut it off and you pull it and it tells you where it needs to be. So anytime I go from regular bobbin to pre-wound bobbin, I always put it in here. And the same thing, when I go back to a regular bobbin that I've wound, it goes back into the TOA gauge and then it comes down to the 220, 220, okay? That's where you need that thread to be. All right, so the TOA gauges saves you a lot of repair work. It's $114.99. Yikes. Yeah, they're high. But I asked for one for Christmas one year. I got it. I got I have one for my machine and one for my quilt machine. And boy, I don't have to call in for trouble anymore because I just put it in here and it takes care of most of my problems. Okay. So the bobbin case tension guide is $114.99. And it's mine number 10, mine number 10. Okay, so back to threads. Janice wanted me to tell you about. Okay, so I've told you about Signature, right? Then we also have Permacore. This is also, you can use on the long arm or your regular machine. This is 30 weight. So 30 weight is going to be a little thicker even than 40, okay? So 30 weight is what these Permacore and I've got a lot of permacore here. These are 10.99, 10.99 a cone, 3,000 yards, 3,000 yards. So that's a lot. Of, this will leave lint, but if you need thread, um, we have the great RFL thread. This is 30 weight, so I would use this like on making bags, uh, sewing up any denim, anything thick, okay? Because 30 weight is a little bit thicker, and it will go through your machine. Again, use your toe gauge, okay? This will go through your machine. It'll wind on your bobbin just fine. I use it, just depends on what I'm making, okay? So Permacore, we have white, we have pink, we have uh, Berry Shake, we have Violet. There's a Violet. Here's a Nickel, okay? It's kind of a gray. This one is Ash, and it's, another, it's kind of a gray. Um, dove gray, we have natural and mother goose. Mother goose, just so you know, is kind of a um, ecru and it goes on almost everything. I use mother goose a lot. That looks like a goose. Yeah. So we have all different colors. If you just pick the color that you want, we can get it if we don't have it. And these are $10.99. Okay. $10.99. And that's for permacore. So that would be my number 
11, mine number, or no, wait a minute. Yeah, mine number 11, okay? And that's permacore thread. And then tell me what color. Now, if you're a long armor, you might want two spools because you put one for your winder and one on the on the top. If you want two, be sure and put times two, okay? Okay. Then I want to pop in here real quick and do the mono poly. Okay, so we have the um, smoke and the clear. This is the clear thread. I don't generally quilt with this because I want the thread in my quilt to be soft. If you put this in it and it has a cut in it, it's going to be stiff and it's going to poke you. So I don't like to quilt with this. Um, if I do a wall hanging, of course I use this. This is great. You don't have to keep changing colors. You can do it in clear. You can do it in, in spoke and you have the whole thing quilted and no, it's not going to poke anybody. So these are great. I have used these and I've tried to wind the bobbins, which is almost impossible to wind with this stuff. I hate doing that. So we have pre-wounds. Sorry, the mono poly. We have the smoke. Let's do it first. Um, is mine 12? It's $8.99. Both of them are $8.99, so we'll do the smoke, and it's going to be, um, or mine 12, I guess. Is that right? We're not with it tonight, y'all. Okay, and then the clear is going to be um, $8.99, and that's mine 13. Okay, mono poly. Okay, then he's going to get that, he's going to get that number up there in a sec. Do you want these to look at? Okay. Okay. Clear, mine 13, and smoke. Yeah. Okay. So let's do this the same way. These are pre wounds. So these are on class 15 bobbins. Okay. So let me tell you this a class 15, if you can see that, it's kind of a wider this way, up and down, a wider bobbin. A class 66 is going to be a little bit shorter and sometimes has a rounded top and bottom. So this is a 15 and a class 66 has the rounded top and bottom, okay? Most machines are gonna use a 15. There are some machines that use a 66, okay? So you can look and see what, what yours is. Um, these are $15.99, $15.99, pricier because it is worth it to me not to have to wind these, it just makes a big old bird's nest in the bottom. So the Monopoly uh, smoke is going to be mine, what is it? 14, mine 14. And the clear will be mine 15, mine 15. Okay, and you're getting um, 2,200 yards. So 2,200 yards in this one package, 2,200 yards. Okay, three, six, nine, 12. You're getting 12 of them, dozen. All right, so I'm, thank you for staying with me. I'm gonna still educating you here on some threads. Okay, so again, now we have RFL, and RFL's fame to claim, right? Claim to fame, got that backwards. Claim to fame is no no um, lint. So we have these big ones like this. This is actually not RFL. This is YLI. So we also have YLI. This one happens to be a purple variegated. There you go, Joyce. A purple variegated, and this one's $24.99. And it has on there 3,000 yards. 3,000 yards, okay? So the YLI variegated is $24.99. YLI variegated, $24.99. And I think, is this YLI? This is YLI. Okay, so like I said, variegated is much higher because you've got the different threads and you've got the long uh, cotton that they're putting together for your thread. All right, um, did you get that one, the variegated? Okay, then here's a gray, and I use gray a lot, you guys. I either use cream, white, black, um, and I have a lot of colors, but if I don't have the color I'm using that I'm, my fabric is, then I'll use gray. 
gray seems to hide in everything. Here it goes. Okay. Um, gray seems to hide in everything. And this one has 3,000 yards on it. It's $11.99, $11.99, and it is 40 weight. So 40 weight is going to fit good in your machine. 50 weight fits better, but 40 weight will go in your machine. Again, you're going to need your stand to put this on. This is not going to fit. It might fit on the back of some machines if you have that extra extension, okay? All right. So $11.99 for solid colors of um, YLI. YLI. Okay. Then we get to Arafil. And I have a few. I have, I just brought one over. So Arafil um, thread, again, is expensive. It's just expensive. But man, it doesn't, if you ever work with it, you'll know why. It is wonderful thread. So this is, um, 50 weight. So this is 50 weight. So this would go great on your machine. Again, you need the spool holder, right? And this one is $52.99. $52.99. But you're getting 3,000 yards. 3,000 yards on a spool, okay? So that's still going to be cheaper to go this way. Okay, then we have variegated. Again, the variegated... Let's see how much is on this variegated. Oh, that's 3,000. This spool must have. Hmm. That, I can't read the thing. I thought that was a 3,000 yard spool. I need to check. Look in there. Look here, Bill. Take this and let me see if it's 3,000 yards. Okay, these are 3,000 yards. These are variegated, and these are Arafil. And these are cheaper. These are 3,200. Uh, 3,200. Oh, my gosh, you guys. I need to go home. $32. $3,200. There you go. $32. Okay, so we have kind of a yellow and brown. Go good on that quilt. We have purple and pinks. Okay, kind of actually light purple and dark purple on this. We have the orange and the yellow. Oh, okay. All right. My bad. I'll have to go back to that one. Okay, and then we have a blue and we have a green. Okay, so we have all these um, in RFL and they're $32 for 3,000 3, yards, you guys. So that's pretty good. Those are variegated. Variegated. Variegated Arafil, $32. And they, if you guys can put out there uh, mine, what number is that? Are you on? And then put the color, the color that you want. Yes. Thir no, 32 even. 32 even. Okay, so this one I was wrong. There's more than 3,000. There's 6,000, over 6,000. So this is double that. That's why. 52.99 has got 6,000 on it. All right? So that's the R feel that we was, what did what was this one, mine, the one before? Okay. This was mine 18. Whoops. Oh, live TV. Okay, just about done here. I'll tell you about these threads and these bobbins and, I use variegated on jelly roll rugs. I do too, Joyce. On jelly roll rugs and bags, I almost always use, I don't know that I've ever used plain. I've always used variegated. And really, truly, most of the time that I sew, I use variegated. I like the variegated. If I've got a quilt I'm putting together and I'm using, um, you know, several different shades of blue or several shades of something, I just tend to like variegated. It just kind of hides in everything, looks good on everything. And then if you decide to top stitch, you need a variegated thread. You need a um, something that looks really good. Either you're going to have to match all the colors in your quilt, or you can get a variegated and do one thread for everything. Hence, that's why I use variegated. Okay, so let me tell you a little bit about um, spools. I had a book. There we go. Uh, the spools from Arafil, which is what we sell. Okay. 
the regular spools that we have the big cabinet of have an orange end. See the orange here and up here? Okay, they have the orange ends, right? That's 50 weight. Orange means 50, okay? And if you need, I have these books that are on top of the shelf over there. You're welcome to take one. And this tells you all about the different threads, okay? So the orange spools, which is what I carry every color in, we've got every color that you can imagine, um, is 50 weight, all right? So I have three different, these all look the same. There's three different colors, but any, any color that you want, we have in our fill. And they're $15.99, $15.99. They went up, up on us last year. So $15.99 for a spool. And this has got, let's see, 1,300 meters. Well, that doesn't tell me nothing. What's a meter? How much is a meter compared to a yard? I want to know yards. Okay, Bill's looking that up. <laughs> okay, so orange means 50. Then we have another section over here. 1420. Okay, 1,420 yards, 1,420 on this, all right? So you can see 1,420 or 6,000, okay? All right. Um, then we have the gray spools. So see the gray, gray up here, gray down there. We have several, several different colors, which are fill. You know, we've got several colors of everything, but these are the gray spools. Okay. Um, that's 30 weight. So that's what I use when I make bags or I'm going to do a jelly roll rug or I'm going to... Um, work on jeans or denim, like the quilt that I'm working on in the back that's got the denim circles, you know, that I put the um, bandana print in. For those of you that came in and see the demo, that you want to use 30 weight, okay? 30 weight thread on the denim is not going to pull out. It's going to be, it's going to be staying in there, all right? So 30 weight on anything heavy, anything heavy. When you do heavy stuff also, I'm going to stop on the thread for a second and tell you this. You need a jeans needle. Did you get this regular R fill? Okay. So you got R fill 50 weight is $15.99, mine 20. Put a color. And then the 30 weight is $15.99. Nope. Sorry. That's $14.99. $14.99. And it actually, I think that's wrong, but, um, and it's mine 20. Mine 20, okay? 21. Or 21, sorry. Okay, so when you're doing bags and rugs and anything heavy, uh, denim or flannel, anything that you're going to have thickness in or several layers, you want to use a jeans needle, okay? This is a jeans needle for your sewing machine, and it's a 9014 jeans. And the, the reason that shaft is thicker, OK, so that shaft is going to go down through that. And when it tries to go through those, it's not going to break on us. OK, I keep jeans needles always because I, I tend to go through lots of layers when I do bags and stuff. So, oops, jeans needles is going to be mine 22 and it's two dollars and ninety nine cents two ninety nine. OK, so that's the jeans. Um, then we also have embroidery needles. There are two, four, five in these packages. And this is a 7511, 7511. And this is made for embroidery, okay? So if you're going to embroidery by machine, yes, you need to change your needle because you're going to have the really fine thread and you don't want a really thick needle like a jeans needle. You want that shaft to be much thinner and that's going to get you in the embroidery, okay? So embroidery needles are $2.99, $2.99, mine 23. Okay. And then tell me how many packages you guys want. Sometimes like I'll order five or 10 packages and keep at the house just all the time. So how many ever you want. Okay. Then we go into, I think that's all I have right now of these. And then we go into the Schmitz. Okay. So Schmetz, this is five universal needles. Universal, you can use on pretty much anything. You're not going to probably, these are probably going to break if you're going to do bags or rugs 
or denim. I mean, anything that's thick, you're going through layers. Universal is not going to be thick enough. But Universal is going to do most items quilting-wise, okay? So that's Universal. Those are $4.99 for five, okay? Then we have the quick threading. Whoops, let me go back. Universal is $4.99, and that's mine, what number? 23? Mine, 23. Oh, you never got the embroidery out there, though. I'm confusing him yeah, totally. Okay, here you go. Let's do the embroidery needles. Okay, the embroidery needles, sorry. Embroidery needles, $2.99, mine $23. Okay, the universal needles are $4.99, mine $24. Mine $24, universal. Okay. Then we have quick threading. So the quick threading needles, if you have trouble threading your needles, this is a really good needle. And it's really hard to see, but if you can see that, see that red dot behind the needle? Okay, you see that, that little hole in the needle? You just take your thread, you slide it down the needle, it catches in there, and you pull it to the back. That is your uh, quick threading needle, all right? Quick threading needle. And there's five of those in there, and it's $6.49, $6.49. These are really good needles. If you can't see to thread them, this just works great. Okay, then we have uh, Singer sometimes has their own, pardon? $6.49, $6 yep, for the Schmitz Universal. Yeah, mine 24. Oops, that says 99 cents, that's not right. Did you, oh, that still says nine, 99 cents. Uh-oh. Oh, guys, live TV. Don't we love it? Okay, I've got three more needles I'm going to show you and some bobbins, and we're going to be done. Can you exit out of that? Okay. Hang on. Let's, there we go. Okay. All right. This one is quilting needles, quilting needles, Schmetz quilting. So if you're going to be quilting and you've got your backing, your batting, and a top piece that's pieced, you're going to need the quilting needle. Okay. You're going through three layers. You don't necessarily need the denim or the jeans needle, but you do need the quilting needle. All right. And one of the best ways you can put them back in your package we also have a pad that you can stick your needles on so you can put them in there so you know what needle you've used. Um, you can also get a red tomato pin cushion and just write on it with a marker. You know, this is jeans. This is universal. This is quick threading and put them in each little uh, section of tomato so you know what needle it is, okay, that you've got in there. Okay, so quilting needles are $5.99, $5.99. Pardon? Number 26, mine 26, and that is quilting needles. Okay, pardon? 5.99, yep. Okay, then we have the twin needle. So if you're needing to do a double line, okay, and, and um, with one line on the back, you're gonna need the twin needle, okay? So that's going to do one, two lines on front, and one line on back, and I thought my shirt had that, but it doesn't, um, $4.99, $4.99 for a twin needle, okay? Okay, so this says you use suitable presser foot and throat plate, adjust zigzag dial to zero, position to slight offset, make sure that needle does not hit the throat plate and thread each needle individually from separate spools. One bobbin, two spools. Okay. And that is, you got the twin needle, $4.99. Great. Okay. Mine 27. Okay. And then we have the singer. Some people still have singers out there. And well, there's several singers. Um, this is regular point needles. There's five regular point needles and it's $5.99. $5.99. 
Okay. So that's that. Now, I'm going to show you these bobbins real quick. We're getting close to our hour here. Okay. So a lot of people will come in and want just pre-wound bobbins. I love pre-wound bobbins because... I don't have to take the time to wind them, right? Um, here is a package of, this is class 15 bobbins, the little bit wider bobbins. Remember the 66 are a little bit narrower. Um, this is $4.99, $4.99, and you're getting 12 pre-wound colored bobbins. So you're getting a little bit of all the different colors uh, bobbins, okay, for $4.99, $4.99. Okay, so that's 12 reusable bobbins. Then we have another thing that's reusable bobbins. So this one is, let's do uh, reusable bobbins one and reusable bobbins two. Different colors, okay, different colors. Okay, so this has got some more, this has got darker colors in it, I think. So one and two, they're both $4.99, and they both have 12. So one and two. Actually, okay, this is, this is the difference. Let's do number one. I'm going to really mess you up now. Yeah, okay, reusable, reusable bobbins. The pre-wound colored, this is class 15. This is class 66. I just seen that. When I laid it down, I thought, oh, those are smaller. So see if you can tell the difference. See how small those are and how tall the other. These are taller and these are smaller. So this is 15. This is 66. Okay. 15 is mine 29 and it's $4.99. And then class 66, the little smaller ones, okay, same price, $4.99. Bill is in a tizzy tonight, y'all. Okay, then we're going to go to Super Bobs. A lot of people go for these. Class 15, yep. And you get the other one, class 66. Okay. Okay. A lot of people go for these. We've got different colors, and I took these off the holders over there, so it's got the colors written on the holders. So let's see. This is granite. Here we go, granite. And these are, how much are these? $14.99. $14.99, you get 12. And uh, this one's granite. Okay. Yeah. Bacon. Okay. So on these, do mine 31, mine 31, and it's granite. Mine 32, are you doing that? Mine 32 is going to be blanc, which is white. You can just put white. Okay. That's the same. Uh, $14.99, $14.99. Okay, then we have bisque. Bisque, let me see the colors. Bisque. Oh, you're just going to do pre-wound. Okay, do pre-wound $14.99. You don't have a mine in there. Um, pre-wound $14.99, it's mine what? Depending on the color. Okay, just put it in one color. And you guys can put the color that you want on it, okay? So again, we have granite, we have white, we have bisque, B I S Q U E, we have parchment, a little bit darker, a little bit darker than the bisque, okay? We have black, which is called raven, if you want the actual thing, raven. And we have graystone, which is a gray. Okay. Oh, I forgot this one. Nightscape. That's kind of a brown. Nightscape is brown. Okay. And if you have any questions, just call us, you guys. 
uh, our number, Bill can put our, type our number in out there. So you guys can give us a call and we can help you. Sorry, it was such a mess tonight. So anyways, um, it was a nice cooler day. Donna wants to know if those ones you just showed, the three rounds you just showed are 15 or 16. These are class 15. Um, these are all class 15, I believe. Yep. Yeah, these are class 15, Donna. Most everything that we have is 15. Let me see if we've got, if these are, if we have any 66. And another thing, if you see bobbins, this, this says L style. You want the L style for a regular sewing machine. If you have a long arm, you would think L style would be for long arm, but it's not. It's for regular machine. Long arm machine is M, style M. Okay, if that didn't really confuse you now. <laughs> okay. So, um, 15, class 15 on all the bobbins, on the pre-wounds. If you want class six, 66, we have um, bobbins that are not full, that are empty, and we have them in trays of 66 and 15. So, just holler, we've got all that. Okay. I think that's all I have for you tonight, you guys. Uh, Cherie had to go home early today because, um, she had something going on. So we did not get the, the live, uh, video ran. So next week, again, we're running behind next week. We are going to have two giveaways. Okay. Two giveaways next week. So the ones that were on last week that are on tonight and the ones that are on tonight for next week. Okay. So you guys have a great week and we will see you next week. All right. Bye now.